Hey, what's up guys and gals? My name is Rick Nigy. Thanks again for joining me. We're going to be playing City Skylines. Now this has the massive, uh, the massive, the mass transit update. So hopefully you will enjoy this. If you're not familiar with what this game is, as you can see in the background, we do this. We basically build a city and no two cities will ever be alike because you place things where you want. You make roads, you add parks and, and homes and it's so detailed. It's such a great game. If you've played or have seen my Banish series, then you will absolutely love this. I do want to at least make this a mini series. I want to do a few episodes because I absolutely think we can have a ball of a time. Now, I've already picked a map that I want to do. I've never played Regal Hills. You can see all the natural resources here. So we do have a bit of oil, but not as much, just the least of all the resources. We have ores, though. We also have farming and finally forestry. Look over here, and there's a bit of water on the map, uh, close to a little more than a quarter of the entire map. But we do have three quarters of the map that we can build on with all of these things, uh, ship connections, plane connections, and so that is great. Uh, we're going to start the game over here. It's going to take a little bit to load, but I will absolutely um, meet you at the start of the game. Alright, here we are guys and gals. This is the piece of land that I'm allotted. You can actually buy more later on. And so we can move this way. We move down this way. We move this way. But look, we have a highway or an interstate. We call it here a freeway basically in my area. And look, we have a river that kind of runs through it. This is weird because I'm usually used to like a huge body of water here. But look, we have some ruins up here which can make like a tourist location. That's kind of cool. I've never had that before at least in my world and look it's very flat um, this looks like farming area right here doesn't it I think it does I can't tell but I think that yellow that's what the yellow color means okay I don't want to get too crazy with building this I did have some things in mind I am going to do something though and that is I am gonna start elevated roads I'm not gonna waste all my money and go all the way down with these elevated roads but I think I'm gonna make a way going this way and I'm gonna go down I'm gonna do something different I've never done something like this before at least on any of my let's plays or any of my private worlds or anything like that and the reason I'm doing this is because I want to upgrade these later to highways and have this go pretty much all the way down so we have crazy or quick access to highways and we're not building all this traffic. So I'm thinking ahead, thinking a little bit ahead, and uh, hopefully that will help us out. Now this is great, because our water source is very, very uh, simple. It's right here in this area, so it's very close, and that's what we need. Now we're gonna start with the water pumping station. Now this is where we get the water that we need to drink. So let's see, the end is over here, so that's where we wanna put the sewer stuff. So we wanna get the clean water from maybe here. We don't want it too far down because uh, then we're going to have issues. You see the water flow over here, the arrows. It's not huge water flow, but it is something. And then the sewer, I think I'm going to put down over here somewhere. Uh, and that's where all the poop stuff is going to go. And let's connect these awesome things. Let's get some electricity. We're going to use windmills to start out because they're very, very simple. So let's place a windmill here. Now, I could string these across and that could help out. So maybe let's string these across. 1200 bucks, that's expensive. All right, but at least we're gonna have both of these babies powered. Look at that, there we go. And there we go. So how much do we need of electricity? Well, it's showing zero right now. We're producing seven. Every windmill, I think, can produce a maximum of eight. Uh, but right now, we're not, we're not gonna do that. So I think I'm gonna build the homes near this area, at least just for right now. Just for right now, then we can change and expand and so forth. So. I'm going to do a couple roads, or just let me do one road, and I think we will build toward the highway. Not the most ideal position to have a home, but it's better than nothing, right? I think my people will like it. So let me start building, and you guys are going to notice as I play how this game works. And I kind of will try to explain things along the way. Hopefully you enjoy it. So I'm going to zone this land. So I'm going to say here I want some residential. So I just click there and there's lots of cool different tools that I can use. I can use a little brush tool just like that, which is awesome. It's kind of like painting and it's really, really fun to use. I think I'm going to place more homes over here. I have no problem. See that painting tool? That is awesome. So that means I'm saying, hey guys, you can build 
homes in that area only. Now they're going to need water, so I think I'm going to run the water down here just like so and go upwards a little bit. And there, so we have full coverage. See that? And my goal right now is to make enough money. Oh, there we go, our first homes. That is awesome. Look at that. And now the game details, guys and gals, are so, so great. Look, the roads get named. That's part of the mass transit update. That's actually free. I did pay for the DLC. And there's other stuff that comes with it, other cool, cool things. But we're going to start to see homes popping up. And so the homes get built. And then when we have people move in, we will see them moving in. You'll see trucks coming in. It's really, really cool. It's really realistic in that sense. We should see trucks coming in any second. But we haven't yet because we need electricity. This needs to be kind of a nice area before they move in. So let's get some electricity over here. 600 bucks. Now the electricity is like a plague. It kind of spreads through time. So the more you build, if we build more to here, the electricity grid will build and so forth. Uh, so something to keep in mind for the future. Now these roads were obviously going to update later on. See, like this, it's going to destroy that. See, now the electricity moves here, but that creates a problem because these guys still need to get powered. So, there we go. Alright, see, they just lost power. That red means they lost power, but when that activates, there we go. They're going to get power back again. Okay. So, what do we have here? Uh, we still have the usual stuff. We have one-way roads, and all these in black we'll be able to get later. We have gravel roads. We have these larger roads, which I probably should place over here. So I'm going to do that, because this is more of a transited area, so let me do that. I don't need to, it's not an obligation, but I think I should. So let me just add and make this like that for right now. There we go, it's very simple. And we'll keep these that go into the homes one way, meaning, not one way, but cul-de-sac. So they'll turn back and boom, and go back to where they need to go. That's great. Now see these bars tell me the desire for demand. So it says medium demand there, medium demand, and medium demand for offices or industry. So no electricity, you see that? Okay, that's because... Okay, why is that a thing? Oh, because this thing. Ugh, you're so annoying, buddy. So annoying. Let's just... Let me do something like that. There we go. And we'll delete this dude. We'll delete that dude. And these wires, I know they look crappy right now, but we'll fix it, we'll fix it. Okay, so we got water, water's not an issue. Let's give these guys somewhere to work. Just for now, just for now, don't freak out. We are gonna connect these, okay? We're gonna connect these. I'm gonna make a road going this way. And we're gonna put some industry over here. We wanna separate the industry or the jobs where these people will be working with a little bit of space because these create pollution so we don't really want to put the residential areas with the industry or the, or the residential with the industry so let's start I think this area and just do this and that for now and that why not why not why not uh, we can always adjust this and I think I will do something like that and let me continue this way and nope right there we want to get full coverage we don't want to get lax on this coverage so there we go now these people are going to need electricity as well they're going to need some type of power so i am going to connect the grid see that just connect it across the highway there and for now that's going to work look at that isn't that cool i think that is so so awesome new zone available what does that mean so the low density, right? What's this? D zone. No, we're not going to D zone right now. We want to build some commercial areas. Now, where can we build those? Well, we can build those anywhere we want, actually. Actually, so I'm going to do this. I'm going to build. I'm going to make these residential, but I'm actually going to start with a little bit of commercial, just on the ends, just on the ends. So a little bit of commercial there, a little bit of commercial there, and there. We'll leave these for home uh, little areas right now. Why can't I build? Why? Why is that not a thing? I don't want to build. Oh, there we go. I was like, where are the regular roads? Why aren't they here? Okay. So we got to just be careful with the power situation. So the power doesn't get lax. 
let me see. I'm going to move this. See, we can adjust, guys and gals. We can adjust these wires because they can get in the way. I want to build stuff here, but you see how it's not letting me. So, yeah, let's do that. Connect over here. Wait till that kind of does its thing. And then we'll delete the, the uh, one right here. Because see, that's just getting in the way. There we go. So now we can build what we want to build. Because we see we need more commercial. The people are demanding a lot more commercial. We can make a road down here. Now look, we're coming to the end. Which is not a horrible thing. But don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. We will figure it out. There we go. Now these guys have water, so that's great. Isn't that cool? Now you can zoom in and look. You can see what these businesses are. Look, big bike. Look at that. Over here right next to it. It's like Panda Express. Look at that. It's like an um, Asian food uh, market. Chinese food. Quiet corner. Look at that. Pennies. That is cool. Gas station. This is just amazing. The detail they have in this game. And these are the roads. And like I said, we're going to upgrade them to highways later. Don't worry. And we're going to have these go under. I have a plan. I do. Kind of. A little bit. A little bit. Just a little bit. Which um, I could. Could I start doing that? I'm going to try. Okay, I'm going to pause the game. I'm going to remove these. Okay, just for a little bit. And I'm going to build these these roads go under. Oh, I cannot. Really? Why not, buddy? Why not? Because of the stuff up there? No, you should be able to build that road for me. Oh, is it because of that? Because of that little thing in the middle. That evil little thing. Although these now... Okay, wait, let, let me do the one under first. Okay, so let me, no, why not? Because you got your stuff there. Can I make you a little bit taller? See, this game has a lot of things where you have to kind of improve what you're doing or add things and so forth. So you kind of got to think sometimes how you want to do things and so forth. And it is challenging. Okay, maybe not like that. Up. Oh, one. Two. No, I don't want to do that. Huh. Okay, there. Let's do that. And from here, let's go up another level. Okay, you tell me the road won't go under that? You're, you're really telling me that, buddy. You really are? Alright, let's try that again. Sometimes if you build things again, see, look at that. That's what I wanted. Okay, now I can do what I want over here. I can do what I want. There we go. It takes a certain type of finesse, guys and gals. There we go. That's what I want. You see that? It's exactly my thing. Now, from here, I can just connect these later on. And we're going to make little bridges. Little bridges, if we need to, to connect these for the highways. Uh, so that the people can come back and forth. And we'll have on-ramps. So we'll have people come like that. And then for this, bloop, it'll be, it'll be cool. It'll be cool. Believe me. Okay. Let's add, well, we need more commercial. Really, you guys are spendthrifts. You guys spend so much. Okay. Let's get time rolling again. All right. Can't wait for it to be day because I want you to just see the game in more clear light than this. You know what I mean? Because it's kind of hard to see what's going on. All right. Let's look at the electricity grid. It seems like that is pretty much covered. So, you see what I mean? Now, I could delete this. And I could even, I could even do something like... And so, because I want to get this area free, I want to get this area free right here. There we go. And we're down to not that much money. Not that much money at all. But I think placing uh, these residential areas is free. So I am not freaking out so much. There we go. And I guess we'll place all this residential. Why not? Let me just add the water. Oh, these guys need water. So let's do some diagonal water stuff. Is that a thing? I think so. There we go. So now it's it's all watered. All water is... Ooh, why is that turning that color? Is, this, is it working? Is it working? Let's fast forward just a little bit. And see if we can get some stuff going. So let me click on this, guys. Uh, little Hamlet. I have 460 people. Small little area. Oh, excuse me. Our next goal is 460. Sorry, we have 225 and our city's growing. This is the number of people... We just added four. This is our money, and this is how we're making. So we're making money. We're making 75 um, euros, uh, 75 dollars. What do you want to call it? 84. 
And uh, next time we're going to be getting, when we get to here, we're going to be getting garbage, healthcare, and education, which is great. We're going to be getting schools, medical clinics, and a landfill. Because these people produce garbage, so we definitely need that. And this is a really big... So you see how the demand's really low for industry? So we're going to dezone that. Because it's just too much. Now we're going to later expand, but the thing is with now, what we have, that's just too much. See how all these people... They need people to work here. So we need to bring in more customers. We gotta bring in more people to live here. So let's add, there we go, another road. We're just increasing the, the supply of people. That's just what we're doing. And, and hopefully it'll benefit us. So let's do that. And this, I don't like that right there. We're gonna fill that in later, guys and gals. Don't worry about it. We just gotta add some uh, water pipes over here hopefully the electricity spreads in this area see that because we definitely need that now this all says people oh yes because this is all what do you what you call it it's all this stuff it's all this business so um, we're gonna dezone all this it seems like we're dezoning more than what people need really and so I'm gonna take that away and just go from there we're gonna keep stuff going and oh I wish I could change the name of my town can I not change it I gotta change it there we go Rick 9g land there we go that seems like a normal name okay Rick 9g land now all these mean people not enough workers same thing here so wait that means we need more people our town needs more people it does it really really does now, let's see. This is interesting because we have this road. Now, my thing is, should we get a road going split under this? Probably. Probably. I don't know. That's a good question. I didn't think about that. I don't think so. Maybe we should have a road going on either side of these things. I don't know. I'm just doing something different. I'm doing something completely different. I know that's a lot of money. And these people don't like it because they have a big road right next to them but I and that's not even is it it's it is not it is not even at all huh I don't want to make the roads too close then see because that will happen so I might have to settle with that but remember the highways are big they're big roads so we'll have to think about it guys and gals. I don't know I don't know what we're gonna do I don't think this will even fit under see nope so we might have to do something on the side. I don't know. I don't know, guys and gals. We'll have to figure it out. So all these buildings are abandoned. We have a crisis. We have an industry crisis right here. When these buildings are abandoned, you gotta get rid of them. Gotta get rid of them because they just mess up everything. There's not enough people. The demand of people is not here. So let me upgrade a couple of roads. Let me upgrade. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Don't want that did the wrong thing or I did what I didn't want to do did what I didn't want to do I guess so okay electricity we have a problem there we go Houston we have a problem okay I might make a road coming from here made from here is that that does that make sense or should I just demolish this whole area I think I'm gonna do that see these decisions decisions guys and gals I'm gonna leave that open I'm going to leave that open because we need roads here. Where are we going? We don't need roads. Well, we do right now. We really do. So, see, even that kind of works. That, I think, I know they don't like it. We might have to separate it with a little bit of business here. But that's okay. It is what it is. So, from here, we're going to do maybe another big road. Should the road go this way? Should it go this way? Oh, so many choices. So many things. Let me go down a little farther and continue with the homes. There we go. And again, I'm not going to connect these. Should I connect these? It's going to create a bit of a traffic log. So I'm not going to... Uh, okay, maybe not. Maybe not. We'll just connect them. No, I don't like that. That was so crooked. So crooked. Not cool. Super crooked. Super crooked? Sure, we'll go with super crooked. There we go. Okay. So we need more homes. So let's have homes here and here. Look at that. That's that's kind of funky because of that road right there. I'm not liking that road. I am not. So let's get rid of it. If I don't like it, we'll fix it. There we go. Okay, these people need water. 
They're thirsty. This, this, this makeup guys and gals of this town and how it is is not what I'm used to. Okay, look at this. Electricity consumption five. And we have four megawatt. Wait, really? Oh yes, because we have one of these. Let's add one right there. Should be getting even more. We should add. Wow, we are dirt poor right now. We are dirt poor guys and gals. This is not. This is not a cool thing. We can't build any more roads. How do we run out of money so fast? Well, we did. We did, and the episode's coming to a close, so we kind of in trouble. Look at that. That's 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 not a cool face to have at the end of the series. Episode one. I do want you guys to see how this will pan out because uh, it will be interesting. It will be interesting for sure. Now, see, I can delete all these guys because you see the grid has spread. So I don't need all these yucky, disgusting-looking uh, wires, wire things. That's no. There we go. So we can we can delete some of this. So we can delete. This. No, 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 don't, 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 don't delete that. No, I. Oh, look at that. So at least you can see it during the day, guys and gals. There we go. There's some money that's coming in. We'll have to just just figure it out. We'll have to figure it out. Just put some homes over here. Put some homes over here and over here. Look at that, look how fast we're coming out. This big gap over here is weird. Why is it like that? That is, uh, I guess the spacing makes it like that. So it is what it is. We're not gonna get perfect coverage, but that's okay. We have some money that's coming in. We're gonna have to get a loan, guys, and gals. We are, so we don't even have enough money. Look at that, it's kind of pitiful. Kind of pitiful, 300 bucks, 300 bucks. And we should maybe be making a little more with taxes. Oh, there's my timer. We can't adjust the taxes right now. We might have to do that in the next episode. Uh, but uh, we can adjust this a little bit. We can adjust this a little bit. And this. And that. I usually don't do that, but look at that. So we see our income starting to go up with the stuff that we did. There's a whole breakdown of everything. We kind of have a lot of expenses, uh, but we are making some money right now, and we're going to adjust those in a little bit. We're not too worried about that. Let's get rid of all these abandoned buildings. They will get built up, hopefully, in a little bit of time. In a little bit of time. Uh, they don't have electricity. That is unfortunate. There we go. And hopefully, this will work out. But look, this is the start of our city, and I know it's a little rough right now in the sense of we have, like, no money. It's a desperate situation. We don't even have much money to build a road. Look at that. Kind of pitiful. But we can continue building. We can continue building homes. And uh, then we can adjust, guys and gals. Then we can adjust everything. We don't even have much money to build the stuff. So I think we'll leave it right here, guys and gals. I might even off camera just kind of let the game run. And that's not a cheating thing. It's more people moving in, letting them come in, and this money will go up. I'm not going to cheat any money in. We're just going to see what happens and go from there. Give it some time. All right, guys and gals, we'll see you all next time. And don't forget to stay positive. Also, don't forget to leave a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't. We'll see you all next time. And don't forget, be hopeful.